Hi guys, welcome back to my To The Moon Let's Play series And if I'm not mistaken, this is episode 10 So from where we left off, we need to get that roadkill raccoon squirrel? Is it a squirrel? Raccoon or whatnot? I don't know And it's too quiet Where's the music? Oh man, oh man by the way, if you hear something stomping or some or whatnot, it's my hubby. I don't know what he's doing upstairs. Oh, oh come on. <laughs> you scared me. Hmm, deja vu. Yeah, indeed it is. Is it? Oh, I thought it was still close. Oh, yeah, I remember. We broke the, some kind of a, it's a beach ball. Some kind, it turned into a, ah, what's the word, guys? Oh my god, it's so quiet. That's why I'm talking so loud. <laughs> okay, let's get that roadkill and the smell. Yep, I think we have the uh, gloves there. The blue thingy. Okay, let's get this. The kind of things this job gets me into. You gotta do what you gotta do. Oh, I didn't read that. There's a vault container in the car. At least make it other. Okay, let's get it in the car then. Okay, trunk. Is it in the trunk? Oh no. Okay. Okay, what's that? What's with the music? And what's and why where are you going? I What what Dr. Watts? I gotta go take a leak. <laughs> Weird why outside there's a or is he making an excuse? What a mess! The crash shook everything up. Let's see. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, my God. What's that? Can I get one? Ah, here it is. Receive a valve container. Okay. Now to get some of that 30 roadkill. Okay. Let's go and take it out. Ah! Receive, contain, roadkill, all the... Ah, I don't want anything more to do with this. Okay, yeah, I know, I know. Sorry about that, pressing a lot. The insurance bump's gonna be a pain. I know. Can I get this? I did. I thought it was just some... This? Painkillers? Huh. Okay. So let's try to go on this side. Up we go. Oh my god, the controls of this one. That's the only thing. Oh, okay, I can't go there. Then why, game, do you have an arrow up if I can't go there? Yeah, that's the only thing of the cons about this game is just with the controls. Other than that, the story, the dialogues, especially the music is so awesome sauce. Okay. Up we go, Dr. Dr. Rosalind. Uh, all right. I get a tendency to forget some stuff. Always. Okay, here's Dr. Watts. Oh, hey. Did you get the roadkill? It's ready. Great. Go get it, set it up. I'll be right back. Neil? These painkillers, I think they are yours. <gasps> hey! May I ask why you are on them? Um, I wasn't going to tell you, but... But what? Oh, this is embarrassing. A few days ago, I walked into... <laughs> you just walk into a wall like that? What can I say? I was in deep thought. You know how deeply I think? Oh, these are some rather strong pills, Neil. And it was a rather strong concrete wall. <laughs> okay, I hope it's true or else... I don't know. It was a match made in... <laughs> oh my god, I really love the, the writings. Who wrote the, the script or should I say the dialogues? That's awesome. Anyways, you got the road guild, right? Let's hurry, John's dying back there. Oh my god, that's so harsh to say, Neil. You aren't addicted, are you? Are you kidding me? 
I'd overdose before I'd sink to that level of contrived mess. Contrived? Contrive? I don't know. Potato, potato. Okay. Up we go there, Dr. Rosaline. Okay. So what's next after this one, guys? This music again. Boom, boom. So when we get to that exact point, I will send the signal. When I do, I want you to release the valve for about 3 seconds. Okay, certainly. Okay, back to our gadgets. About time, showed up. Have you made sure the germs are sealed off? Fully sealed and filtered. Not like I'd matter to a dead man. Well, that's harsh for you to say, doctor. John is still alive. You should know that Johnny's condition is deteriorating fast. Yeah, we know. This might be your last chance, you two. Whatever you do in there, good luck. Okay. Locks the last thing we need. Okay, I'm gonna wear our... It's like a... A clamshell or whatnot. Okay, where... Oh, it's Act 3 now. They shine their lights at the other lighthouses and at me. Okay, I hope this time around, Joey, John, Johnny, wow, we'll want now to go to the moon. Okay, we're back to his, uh, around seven or eight days years old. Let's go. Okay, we got all the, the stuff for Memento. Okay, hiya. Yep, I saw that one. We got a memento now. So what's next? Ah, yeah. Because maybe the, the connection here, remember on the left side that it was broken? Maybe that's what we need to think how to get for. To think that this little thing's causing us so much trouble. I just want to kick it to the outer space. I suppose all we can do now is to send a signal and hope. Well, ready? Okay. Okay. Oh, that's a signal. Come on, doctor. We're all doctors here. The scientist and the medical doctor. Something's happening. Quick, send it again. What's going on? Doctor, something's wrong. What? Take over for me, Lily. What's happening? His condition has been destabilized. Intake le levels must be reconfigured. Apple, learn to read. What's happening to this place? It's been destabilized. Get out! What? Get out of his memory, now! What are you talking about? If the system doesn't restabilize soon, the shock might permanently damage whoever is in here. You've got to be kidding. Why aren't you getting out then? I can't, Neil. If both of us get under this state, all our work will be reset. There won't be enough time to redo all we've done before Johnny. Oh, you... F uh, don't pull that good creep crap of me. This ain't a movie and you're no hero. You're just being a moron. Then why are you being one too? Get the hell out of here. Screw that, if you're gone, they'll probably pair me up with Alistair. Oh, that's the name of my other Stardew Valley <laughs> playthrough. Anyway, do you know how badly he smells? Worse than the roadkill. Damn it, Neil, this is what I get for helping you cheat through the entrance uh, exams. Okay. I hope John is okay. Oh, thank God, it's stabilized now. I think. Doctor? I think we're okay. For now. Okay, now we're back. Yeah, this, this is the missing part, right? And guess what? Your carrot cake sucks. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah, and at last Christmas party, you... What is it? Come on, guys. Oh. Come on, let's go before that happens again. 
Um, you know that I didn't mean to, you know, call you a moron, right? You know that I did, right? <laughs> Can I get this one? Here goes nothing. Oh. Uh-oh. I should have got to the right, right? I don't know. Hope I did that. Was okay or what not. Okay. Oh. What time? Is this? Oh, when he was a kid. Okay. Cause there was a uh, back before the last episode, right? That Johnny has some kind of memory lapses. Wow, I can't believe that worked. So we actually made it. But now I'm not sure if I'm going to like this place. What do you mean? It seems peaceful enough. Neil, did you notice something odd in Johnny's room earlier? Uh-oh, I didn't notice. What? There was something strange. Did you see not see it? I didn't. What is it? I suppose not. Never mind. I just hope I'm wrong, okay? Please, I do hope you're wrong. Do we need... No, I think we need to go just directly. Okay, no time to wander around. Man, the controls. I can do this one, right? Or the arrow. Oh, I can do the arrow, not the A-E-S-D-W. Oh, man. Okay. Can we? No, I don't think so. Mom? I can't go. Oh, can I go out? Yes, I can. Wow, that sounds fabulous. I know, right? You've got to take them there one day. What's that? Who's this? Oh, I can't either. Oh, I got a feeling. I get a feeling that something... Shh, the time overlap's getting out of hand. Look at how many of them are there. It's like a zoo. Hmm. I think I got a hunch of what happened here. Come on. Ha! Huh. Just like the ball's moving around on its own and he's just chasing it. Okay. Where should we go next? Oh, there's the roadkill. All thanks to this little fella's sacrifice. I hope. Okay. The music's scaring me. Where's the other guy went? Okay. Oh jeez, look at the time. I better get going. The store closes early today. Oh, take care, Martha. Say hello to the boys for me. I will. I'll see you around. I really got a feeling. I really got a feeling what will happen. Well, this is the end of the road. And you were saying... Never mind that. Maybe I was wrong after all. I mean, this place, it's so peaceful. The only thing that exists in this memory that could do such a thing would be... Oh, crapity crap! We need to go back now! Wait, what's going on now? Just shut up and come. Okay, I got a feeling. I really got a hunch. Uh-oh. Oh, come on. Yeah. Uh-oh. Ah, <sighs> Accidents happen like this. Mmm, I knew it. So, oh my god. Whew, so that's the memory lapse. Okay. Then what happened to him then? But he was okay. He lived a long life after this. Wait, what? I don't understand. If he was unconscious, how could we be seeing 
this here when he never did. Still, I'm just surprised that he survived. Actually, he didn't. Oh my god. That's really my hunch. What? Didn't you see it in his room, Neil? Johnny slept on a bunk bed. Oh. Joey! Oh. Why did you hit Joey, Ma? Why did you hit him? Joey, wake up, Joey, wake up! Oh my god. And... This is such a tragedy. Even though they were young, to lose a twin brother, not to mention how their mother must feel. At least Johnny had the better blockers erase the memories. Not like he remembers it much. Fuzzily unlink, not erase. Somewhere in there, the aftermath of those memories probably lingered. What about their mother? I don't think she took the better blockers. She seems to have gone a little cuckoo. Did she? At least I don't really think she called Johnny Joey as a nickname. But if she then takes Johnny for Joey, what about Johnny himself? I don't like it here. Let's move on. Oh man. So that's why his mom... He's calling him Johnny. He's not putting up a barrier anymore. Don't jinx it. Oh man. Yeah. Dude, you should totally give this series a try. I mean, really, it's just wicked awesome. I've already plowed two tree books straight. What's it called? Animorphs. It's about this group of kids turned into animals who fight mind-controlling slugs. Meh, I don't like that weird alien stuff. Why not? It's great. Instead of going to boring school, they get turned to tigers and more big bad aliens. They're all like, raw, 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 and they pick up lasers. And it's all pew 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 They pie <laughs> Stop that My god my heart man <sighs> Just watch Johnny One day I'm gonna be a famous writer Aww Like the coolest novel in the block and every kid will get my book for free I'll make our switch and buy both you and my really big houses. How would you get rich if you give away the books for free? Free for the kids, the parents still have to pay. Of course. <laughs> oh my god, my heart is so... I'm sure the parents will be thrilled to give you money. <sighs> what, you're still mad about the other day? Well, come on, I called first dibs on the train fair at Square. What happened to your prize anyway? I gave it away. To a hobo? Look, it's not just about that day. You know, Ma always favored you. Oh. Hey, that's not true. Remember last Christmas? At last Easter in the time we went fishing and... Okay, okay, you know what? You can have my train if you want. Really? Yup! Oh my god, and he is so good too! I mean, hey, by your reasoning, she'll just get me another one, right? <laughs> he is one smart kid! Listen, Johnny, what difference does it make who owns what? 
Everything that's mine is yours too. Oh my god, Joey is such a good boy. I mean, we both get to play with it, right? Oh yeah. Oh my god. I mean, come on. You're my twin brother, dude. You're like a part of me. Ah, oh, let's go confuse the neighbors. Oh, maybe they started it all. Wait. In the rain? Yes, in the rain. Come on. Mm. So sad, man. I don't have the link. Ooh, we're now on the fair. This is a fair, right? Some kind of carnival, huh? Shall we look around? How about I look around and you just stand here? How about we continue speaking in the form of questions for the next hour? Quit blabbering and go already. Ow, you ruin it. Oh my god. Anyway, guys, I think this is it for me on episode... 10 if I'm not mistaken. Thanks again guys for watching and I hope to see you again on the next episode. As always, take care and say it easy. Bye-bye.